If you jumped in your car heading for the moon and could find roads that would get you there, it would take you about six months to arrive. And that's because the moon is about a quarter million miles away from the Earth, which seems far until you consider how far away the sun is, over 90 million miles, and is so big you could stuff about 1.3 million Earths inside of it. And that's just a tiny piece of an enormous Milky Way galaxy, which is full of 100 billion plus stars. And it's just one tiny galaxy in the billions of galaxies that we've even discovered so far. My name's Levi Lusco, and I'm the author of The Last Supper on the Moon. And I want to read to you from Psalm 8 for today's verses for the day. David said, When I consider your heavens, the work of your fingers, the moon and the stars which you have made, what is man that you are mindful of him, and the son of man that you visit him? He just pictured David out on the palace balcony, not looking over the wall at his neighbor's wife, but lifting his eyes up as we're called to, to lift our eyes and our hearts and set them on the heavens to to remember God, to remember his presence, to remember his power. And all of a sudden, all the troubles, all the cares, all of those things in his life, doing the same thing they'll do for you and for me, dissolving away, remembering the immensity of our creator, of our God, who's known to us in the person of Jesus, who came near, who, who, who would visit us, who upholds everything with the word of his power, Hebrews says, with, as David said, his fingers, not notice his arms, like he's struggling, oh, the Milky Way galaxy is so heavy, could someone give me a hand? Not even his hands, like, I've got this. He's doing it with his fingers, with apologies to your Sunday school teacher. He's got the whole world in his fingers. And the God so big that today we're going to see this solar eclipse and see the blackout of the sun for just a moment, that all of this is happening upheld by him. He cares for you. The God who hung the moon, he loves you and he likes you too.